Keyview can send out monthly statements to your clients. To enable this, go to Settings, scroll down to Auto-Generated Outputs, and select Plan Management Client Statement. Enable the Auto-Generate Monthly Statement setting, then work your way down the page to configure your statements. In the Statement Type field, enable Client Statement Summary. This is the newest statement format and gives you more control over the information displayed for your client's funding usage. You can choose to send statements to clients that already use Careview Advantage. These clients can view their funding and invoices at any time on their mobile phone, so it's your choice if you want to send them a statement as well. Next, you can send a copy of the plan management statement to the client support coordinator if they've been linked to your clients in the individual provider section. If any of your clients prefer to receive their statements by post instead of email, set your internal email address here. When their statements are generated, they'll be sent to your address for you to print out and send. You can set up your clients to receive postal statements by going to their client profile screen, clicking on Edit, ticking the Send Postal Statement option, then clicking Save. Also, if any of your clients don't want to receive a statement at all, tick the Monthly Statement opt-out tick box and click Save. You have two ways to display the client's invoice information on your statements. You can list the paid invoices and their details for the month, or show all the invoices raised during the statement period. With both of these options, you can choose what date is used to sort the invoices. For the paid invoice summary, you can choose invoice or paid date. And for the full invoice detail, you can choose the invoice date or the service date from each line on the invoice. The dates can be shown in ascending or descending order. If you don't want to show any invoices related to your monthly plan management fees and setup costs, exclude invoices related to the Improve Life Choices category. You can also exclude any invoices for support coordination. If you use one Keyview file for plan management and support coordination, then any claims you've made from your own support coordination work are excluded automatically. If you want to report on your own support coordination work, use the support coordination statements instead. If you've set up service provider category budgets for your clients to track the claims from their service providers, you can choose to display these on your statements as well. When sending your statements, a cover letter is included which introduces the statement and the information enclosed. You can choose to use the standard cover letter or write your own cover letter in the statement content section below. If you're writing your own, you'll need to make sure you include a salutation, closing message and sign off in addition to any other messages you want to pass on to your clients. Use the Sent Statement On field to choose when your statements are sent out. If you set this to day one, They'll be sent out on the first day of the month, covering invoices paid or raised for the previous month. Lastly, you can set the name for your statements in the Statement Name field. This name shows on the email subject, the name of the file, and also on the statement itself, and can be up to 30 characters long. When you're happy with your statement settings, click Save. Check the appearance of your statements by manually creating a statement for a client. Go to CRM. Clients, select a client, open their current service contract, and click the monthly statement button. Enter a date range for the statement, then click the Generate PDF button. Go through the statement and make sure each section is showing the information you're after. If you need to change anything that's being displayed, go back to your plan management client statement settings and update the settings as required and then run another manual statement to check your changes. Your statements will be sent out to your clients when the sending date is reached, and you'll receive an email summarizing the activity. This email will be sent to the notification sender email address in your organization settings. If this field is not set, then the summary will be sent to the contact email address instead. If your clients have any questions about understanding the statement, you can send them a link to our Help Center article how to view your plan management statement. This explains each part of the statement for them in more detail.